The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam. First Canto, Ninth Chapter, Text Number 40, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on the 22nd of May, 1973, in New York, New York. Tira 
Translation Let my mind be fixed upon Lord Sri Krishna, whose motions and smiles of love attracted the damsels of Rajatama, the gopis. The damsels imitated the characteristic movements of the Lord after his disappearance from the rasa dance. Purport By intense ecstasy of loving service, the damsels of Rajapumi attained the qualitative oneness with the Lord by dancing with him on an equal level, embracing him in nuptial love, smiling at him in joke, and looking at him with a loving attitude. The relation of the Lord with Arjuna is undoubtedly praiseworthy by devotees like Bhishma Deva, but the relationship of the gopis with the Lord is still more praiseworthy because of their still more purified loving service. By the grace of the Lord, Arjuna was fortunate enough to have the fraternal service of the Lord as chariot driver. But the Lord did not award Arjuna with equal strength. The gopis, however, practically became one with the Lord by attainment of equal footing with the Lord. Bhishma's aspiration to remember the gopis is to pray to have their mercy also at the last stage of his life. The Lord is satisfied more when his pure devotees are glorified, and therefore Bhishma Deva has not only glorified the acts of Arjuna, his immediate object of attraction, but also he has remembered the gopis who were endowed with unrivaled opportunities by rendering loving service to the Lord. The gopis' equality with the Lord should never be misunderstood to be like the Sayuja liberation of the impersonalist. The equality is one of perfect ecstasy where the differential conception is completely eradicated for the interests of the lover and the beloved become identical. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said Ramya Kachi Dupasana Bajavadhu Vadhavija Palpita There is no better method of worship than the system invented by the gopis. The gopis invention of worshipping Krishna was to remain always Krishna conscious without any material problem. That is the super excellence of gopis. They, they never expected any return from the, from Krishna. That was not their business. Oh, Krishna, we have done so much for you. Uh, you cannot give me this benediction. No. They never ask like that. That is the first class verse. Krishna, you take whatever you like from us, but we do not ask anything, neither we have any need. This is Gopi's question. We have got everything to give you, and we have no need to ask you. This is Gopi's question. Generally, 
प्रेवासे गॉड नीनी आर्था अर्थार्थी आर्था मीन्स डिजीज अर्थार्थी मीन्स नीन ऑफ मनी पीपल जनरली गो टू चार्ज टेम्पल वेन दे आर सफरिंग फ्रॉम सम एलिमेंट्स और नीड ऑफ मनी दीज टू क्लासेस एन आर टू क्लासेस जिज्ञासु ज्ञानी ज्ञानी मीन्स हु इज आफ्टर प्योर नॉलेज जिज्ञासु मीन्स इन पीजिटी वट इज द नेचर ऑफ गॉड दीज आर दे आर हायर सेक्शन बट दे आर नॉट भक्तर्स जस्ट लाइक देर आर मेनी फिलोजर्स दे आर ऑल्सो टॉक ऑफ गॉड बट दे आर नॉट भक्तर्स बट बिकॉज दे आर टॉकिंग ऑफ गॉड दे आर गेटिंग सम बेनिफिट जस्ट लाइक इफ यू हैंडल विथ फायर you perceive some warmth automatically so these four classes of man they are not bhaktas devotees artha arthati gani jignar but because they come to krishna for some benefit some or other they offer their service because praying is also another service uh, there are nine kinds of services savanam kirtanam vishnu smaranam padasivanam archanam vandanam vandanam this is also service but because this service is rendered for some motive to mitigate the sufferings artha arthati or to satisfy some inquiries they are not pure devotees so the gopis activity they are the supreme platform of pure devotion there is no other business there is no other business gopis they are not interested to know philosophically that that krishna is god although they are seeing every state krishna is god madhav jasada he see that krishna is god gopi dasa gopi jana vallava giri vara dhari krishna is lifting the govardhan hill who can do it except god they are seeing it still they do not know that krishna is god Krishna is wonderful. That's all. They do not like to know whether Krishna is God or not. They want to love Krishna. Krishna may be God or not God. It doesn't matter. Just like if you love somebody, what he is? Is rich man, poor man, educated or not educated? There is no consideration. Love has no such thing consideration. Similarly. Gopi's love for Krishna was pure. There is no consideration that Krishna was God. Therefore, they wanted to dance with him. No. Krishna wanted to dance with them. Therefore, they came to Krishna. Krishna is now calling by the vibration of his flute at this day of night. So. all these young girls they are all married some of them are mothers who immediately left their home that describe in the simad bhagavata some some of them were cooking some of them were feeding best feeding the children some of them were feeding the husband or the father in this way everyone was engaged but as soon as krishna's flute was heard At the end of night, they left home immediately. All the guardians, generally in India, for young girls, the guardians 
are the father, the husband, the brother, all male members. They formal. Why are they going? Why? Nobody cares. No love for so-called children, no love for home, no love for brother, father, or no respect. It's not. That is gopi super excellence. So that is being explained. And Bhishma death, at the point of his death, he is jealousy. These are to be learned. Unless we are practice to think of Krishna always. How at the time of death we can think of? Therefore, Kula Shekhar says, Krishna tadi apadapankaja panjanantam addaiva vishatu vimhāna sarāja hansya prāna prāna samayi kapabāta pittau Kanthāvarodhalavidho smaranam kutaste. Maharaj Kulasekha, king, a great devotee, who is praying to Krishna. Krishna, this is the opportune time. Now I am healthy. I am quite in good health. So let me die immediately, thinking of it. Because my whole purpose is to think of you, of your past times, at the time of death. So, generally at the time of death, kapubhāta pitta, the whole system becomes disarranged. There are coughing, there are headaches, there are some pain. This is general system. Sometimes they are so intolerable to the man who is going to die, he cries. The system within the body is so complicated that at any time it can be disarranged and it becomes a great source of pain. So at the time of death means the arrangement becomes so dangerously painful that one leaves this body no more. This is death. This bodily arrangement becomes so painful, just like one commits suicide, when the situation is too much painful. He wants to rescue by committing suicide. Similarly, when the bodily pains are too severe, then the living entity cannot live in this body. He gives us this body. So we have to give up this body. That we forget. People have become so misguided that they are memorizing. In our country, some astrologer has said that one big politician, he has become one of the two dogs in Scandinavia. Now here, for this material body, they have erected museum and statues and being worshipped by so many methods. But the spirit soul, which was the politician actually, not his body, he has taken birth as a dog. This is their mistake. Where the politician has gone and how, what he is doing, they do not know. But they are concerned with the body. My Guru Maharaj used to say that one man is drowned, another brave man comes, I will save him. So he jumps over the water and brings the coat and sack. Now this man is saved. So what people will say, what a nonsense is. He has brought his coat and sack, and the man is saved. Similarly, these rascals, they are dealing with the coat and sack of the living entity, 
but they have no knowledge in the university or anywhere where the soul has gone. These rascals have no knowledge. They are simply concerned with the uh, external body. And those who are interested only in the external body, not those who are 99.9 percent population, they are interested in this bodily concept of life. Perhaps we are the only institution in the world which is teaching that you are not this body. This is the wonder of Krishna consciousness movement. We are the only institution throughout the whole world that we are teaching people that, my dear sir, you are not this body. You are different from the body. And after death you get another body. Tatha dehatram prapti. Simple education in the Bhagavad Gita. They do not understand. There are big, big scholars, rascals, all rascals. Our difficulty is these rascals are going on as scholars. Dehatma Buddhi. Their life is bodily concept of life. And they're passing as scientists, scholars, leaders, politicians, and they're leading us. Andhajatandri, they are blind, and they are leading us. So we have been also put into difficulty. So only this Krishna consciousness movement can save the human civilization and get him raised to the platform of the gopi. We have got such nice thing. This gopi is unalive Krishna love. That is what. Thank you very much.